For some stocks with a longer history, TWS charts go back as far as 1980. Right click on a ticker symbol and select the chart icon. Use the chart settings icon to change the time frame remaining on the chart parameters tab. Note the other tabs for adding studies, secondary series and index comparisons. The maximum period displayed using a daily chart is six years. To view the maximum chart history for this ticker, use the time period drop down menu from the expand box next to max, select either line or candle. Note that you can use the bar type drop down menu to select from either high low bar or a choice of candles. Right click in the white space above the display and select configure toolbar. This enables you to add or remove icons to the toolbar. To add a horizontal trend line to the chart, click the Edit Chart button and make that selection. The cursor will control the position of the line until you click on the chart. Right click on the horizontal line and select Remove this trend line to get rid of the line. To add a trend line, simply place the cursor at your starting point, depress the left mouse and extend the trend to another point. Release the left mouse button to snap the line in place. Right click on the trend line and select Draw Parallel from here. Click on the chart to snap the line in place. Right click on any line and select Remove this trend line. To remove all drawn lines, select Remove all trend lines. To expand a selected area within the chart, select the magnifying glass. Hold the left mouse button down and highlight the area to enlarge. Release the left mouse button, having chosen the period to view. The area between the two vertical lines is expanded. To return to the original view, click the Zoom Out button in the toolbar. If you don't see these buttons in your TWS toolbar, remember to click in the white space above the display to open the configuration menu. In this chart, you can see a bad data point. Right click the bar. You can either delete the bar or choose to edit the values. In this case, I'll modify the high, low, open and close by clicking the Replace Bar Data button. When finished, click OK.